Good morning, happy Halloween. This is Morgana Hillrow here, and I'm going to do a quick review of the new head from Wack, and I believe it's called Maxine, which I really should have double checked that before I started this, but that's okay. Because so what I'm going to do is we're going to open the inventory and we're going to get this part done first, because I know a lot of people don't like to stick around for my reviews or my garble or whatever. So I am currently wearing a dress from Apple May called Belle and as you can see it's really cute it's like um, I'm actually wearing I believe I'm wearing the Isis version for some strange reason don't ask me I just I just wear these things <laughs> no I'm wearing the Maitreya which is what I'm wearing right now is the Maitreya body um, a lot of the time uh, people assume that just because you wear the Maitreya version of a body then you're not gonna have to like black out different parts of your body as in use your alpha hut but you do sometimes you know like under the arms as you can see so just keep that in mind I just didn't bother because I wanted to do this quickly. <laughs> All right. I'm also wearing shoes and a cute little accessory from Uber. Well, Glamour Fair that are available at Uber. So these little boots down here are available at Uber. They come in a multiple of colors. Do do do. And also this in item is from Glam Affair for Uber as well. You have to resize it. I did. <laughs> um, I resized it quite a bit actually. <laughs> and then, you know, of course, you have to have like editing and stuff like that. But I mean, as long as you know how to change the size, which you just right click on it, go to edit, um, go to stretch, and then you use, I use the bottom tabs of these things, like this one here and just like move it around to suit your needs and then of course you're going to want to rotate it to fit to fit on whatever it is that you're putting it on ladies you're going to want to put it on your boobs <laughs> all right so that takes care of that um the hair that i am wearing is from tableau vivant and it is actually from the arcade so i'm not sure if it's still available like if there's a place that you can pick it up um i guess you could always just go and check i did not recolor my ears because i was messing around with the color um sorry with the hud all um night last night trying to get it to work and it was just being a pain in my behind um meaning the the skin versus um, the head and blah 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 but we'll do that right now actually but first I want to teach you guys a trick um, a lot of the time you guys like will be looking for um, like an item that you're wearing and you'll go the long way you'll like open up your inventory and start scrolling through looking for it but an easier way to do this is you go to your worn tab and you find the item that you're looking for so in this case I'm looking for we'll go with my ears because I want to change the color of them so you go to the ears or wherever it is that you've got it right click on one of the items and then go to find a main viewer and it will just open up that part that part right there now you got to make sure that this area is clear and that you're not actually searching for something else already but um, you know all in all it works okay so I am gonna plop this sucker on and change the color of my ears there are tons of preset colors so chances are you're gonna find something that works for you now these ears are from swallow and they are available at the store Ooh, that's a little too dark for me it is it is it is let's brighten that sucker up <laughs> Boom. What? No, go away. Oh, hum, hum, ho. There we go. That's good right there. Ugh, keep clicking that hair. <laughs> Do -do -do -do. Better than before. All right, so I'm going to get rid of that now. And then I'm going to close that. And we're going to go look for the head now. Not the body, just the head. Do, 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 do. Find a main viewer. Yay! See? Easy peasy. Okay. Now I'm wearing an applier. I'm wearing the um, 
Glamour Plier, and it is an in-store release. Um, I'm not sure what that says. Is that Achilles? I could be wrong. Um, do, do, do. Maybe there's somebody out there who can pronounce that word right there. And I'm using the logo plier. So that's usually for like Sadie or um, one of the other ones. Chloe, I think, is one ah, from logo. But I decided to wear it with this. Okay. Now I'm wearing Jamaica tone. Okay, so back to this. Here are all the stuff that you get in this um, this head. Oh, my eyes, of course, are from Izzy's. I love these eyes, so I wear them as much as I can. Um, you get your head applier. That's if you have, like, if you want to wear your default body. Then you have your whole body, and this takes care of everything. Basically, it's like wearing an invisible layer. Phew. This is actually perfect if you're going to um, high um, high traffic events. Slap one of these on and you won't have any problems. Well, not coming from you anyway. Then you've got your appliers here. This is uh, the Evelyn that comes with it. And uh, I will show you this in a moment. Um, I ran in some, some trouble, into some trouble. So I don't know if I'm the only one, but I know I came up with it. So I'll share it. You get the the HUD, which is down here, and I'll show you in just a moment. And you get your information, your landmark, and your head. See, I was right. It's Maxine. Yay. All right, so I'll close that for now. Um, wait, I'm going to open it just so that way I know that I'll be able to find this when I need it. Because <laughs> believe me, I will. <laughs> okay. So as you can see, I'm playing with the emotions HUD. I thought that was cute. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Okay, so here is the HUD. Maybe. <laughs> there it is. Okay, so I am going to turn off the... Um, oh, no, no, we want the blinking. I like the blinking. So there is the head with the applier. Um, pretty sure, yeah, everything's good. Okay, so... I'm actually wearing some of the makeup, so we're going to go over here. Here's the features. Um, you've got your brow and lash fit. So you enter your head size. Pardon me, your head size. So we got to go over here. And normally I would have a bigger head. I don't know why, I just do. But my head size is 51, so pop that sucker away. So we'll go and fix this. There's 51. Okay. Ooh, my eyes just went. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Um, scalp size you can go large or small. I don't even know what that means, but off I know what that means. It's actually kind of cool, like especially with um, wasabi hairs. For some deranged reason, I've always noticed that the back of my skull kind of pokes through, so I just take off the scalp. Problem solved. The next size, um, I'm pretty sure mine's okay. Looks good. But if you have like a bigger neck, then you can always change, you know, give it a neck size. My neck blender is off. You don't normally need it. Your Evelyn skin right here. This is with brows, I'm assuming, because the other one's without brows. Here's your eyebrow layer. And you can have the Omega as well. I'm going to have to show you that in a second here. Your lashes. Doo -doo -doo. I guess I'm going to... Hold on. Eyeshadows off, lipstick off. There you go. And then doo -doo -doo -doo. it's got hair base, that's kind of cool. Uh your lashes, they change. Mm -hmm. Different lashes. There you go. And then your lipsticks. Boom, boom, boom. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Da, 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 da. See how quickly those res up for me? I don't understand why there's like one head out there that like one yeah, one head out there that just doesn't res for me. Not with this brand, but you know what I mean. Do 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 Okay. And then eyeshadows on. Go with the black. Oh, it's on already. Do do. Smoky eyes. Mm 
Kind of glow up on top. Kind of a sheer. I kind of dig this one here. <laughs> and maybe this lipstick? Nope. This one. Okay, so we've got that going. Alright, so now I'm going to show you the expressions HUD. Um, I'm showing you all the great positive fun stuff first. <laughs> okay, so you've got your blink. I'm not sure what skip forward means, but I do know with these ones here, um, if you play skip forward, then it kind of freezes the um, action. So parted lips. Now watch, she'll close her lips, I think. Yep, there she goes. Now if you play skip forward, she'll stay like that. Okay, so come out of that. You got your wink. What the heck was that? Uh, there we go. Wait, no, do it again, do it again. Uh, come on, come on, come on. Mm. There you go. Yay. Okay, so I can undo that now. <laughs> Parted lips, I think I just did that. Closed smile. Yay. Open smile. Any day now? Good girl. Bite lip. Good girl. Oh, this is fun. Watch this one. <laughs> Cute. Tongue out. I was joking with Matt the other day. See how her tongue is not pointed? It means she's tongue tied. <laughs> And the kissy face. Do do. Open mouth. Oh, I skipped one. Yes, I have vampire teeth on. I'll go through that in a second. Sad. <laughs> Raised brow. This sounds like it looks like something like something stinks in Siberia. <laughs> So open mouth, which one would be better to use? Is it open mouth that's better? Yeah, I'd use that. Ooh. There we go. Okay, so here are the teeth. Do do do. And my little vampire teeth. I like that one best. Okay. I'm like, oh, I just learned something new. And these are looks, but I never actually played with them. Um, I'm thinking that there's nothing in there, but I could be wrong. Oh, what's this? Oh, okay, see? Psst, I learned something new. So if you want to save the looks that you come up with. So this, um, oh, God, don't let me see that. Go away. Leave me alone. There we go. Um save save skin eyes lips wait let's go back to save all see tita okay so now I got that one saved all right so we're gonna go back here and um, we're gonna have to use one of their skins <laughs> wait let's go to a color close to mine There we go, that's close. Alright, so as you can see, you got the brows there. And um, if you want, and that looks cute like that, right? And the brows all work and everything. However, this is what I ran into. This is the no brows version. And you can actually, this is actually a problem with even appliers. But I thought that I would use this, because maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it's just with the appliers. So we're going to try and see what happens. Maybe. Maybe. Hmm. Something funky's going on. This applier is not working. And it's their applier, so I'm kind of surprised. <sighs> it's just a stress angel out day. You can see? There we go. 
Ooh, there we go. Finally. Maybe I'm just not clicking the right place. Come on. There we go. Okay. So, wait, that's not the right one. Was it two? Come on. There we go. Okay. So there it is without the brows. Okay. So we put the brows on. And right now they look fine. So maybe it was just a res issue or something. I don't know. But we'll find out. <laughs> nope. It was definitely an issue. Do you see? It's not coming on. <laughs> Why'd it go off now? There we go. Maybe I constantly have to hit on. Okay. See? that's. I don't understand what's going on there. It keeps on clicking it off. On, on, on. Yeah, see, it's not doing it. I don't know. It will only do the one color. Not sure why, but, um, yeah. Maybe I have to click the Omega on or something? No. <sighs> so, as you see, I'm running into difficulty with that and that wasn't even the problem so that gives you a clue on what's going on there um, here let me just minimize this real quick and put this applier on this is the glam affair okay and going back to the brow again um, obviously it's going to be mismatched but see it won't put the brow on I don't know what is going on it's driving me absolutely insane last night but you know, there's nothing I can really do about it. So, yeah, there's that problem. Um, not sure how to fix that. So, if you're happy with the skin, um, like the skin's eyebrows or whatever, we'll plop that back up. Uh, let's see if it works with the Omega. Okay, hold on. Arise, arise, arise. <gasps> mm -hmm. Lashes. No, it's not in lashes. Mm, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? I'm looking for something specific. <laughs> I have a slight arise problem. <laughs> Ooh, there's somebody in the backyard. Who is that? Why is it? Apparently the dog here is sees it too. Like dogs barking in the background. Going completely insane. Where is the brow? Okay, so maybe I'm not going to be able to show you because I can't seem to find it. Is that it? No. Sexy brows. There we go. Omega applier. Now this has Omega applier in it. So just keep that in mind. All right, so here we are. Click to apply. Ah, there's the problem. See? Can you see that area here? So that's with the Omega. Fun. And it kind of like, I don't know, flickers? Can you see that? I'm sure it's not just me. Um, I thought, well, okay, maybe it's just not uh, resing or something, right? So I plop this sucker open. Oops, or off. <laughs> okay, come on. Find in viewer, because it's being a pass. <laughs> Here we go. Let's stick it back on. Thunk. And then there's the Omega right there, but I know it's not the color it needs. And then you turn off the mega, turn it on, it doesn't go off. Um, see the brow, see? Turn off that brow, and this is what happens. Because when it's on like this, you can see it's an overlay, right? Um, not 100% sure what is going on with that, but anyway. So take that off. <laughs> I don't know if there's a way, see there's no way to clear the brows on this, right? So you would wish that there was, <laughs> but there is no way to clear that brow off. Once it's on, it's on. 
Um, yesterday I ended up having to unpack a whole different thing just to get the brow layer off. And that's pretty much what I'm probably going to have to do again today. And that kind of sucks. <laughs> I wish there was a way to clear it. But I have yet to find it. Um, and then you're going to see how bizarre it looks with this. Okay, back on. See? There's no way to get rid of that layer. It's just there. So I wish that there was a way to clear that, that layer, the omega layer. You know, see, it doesn't come off. The omega is unclicked, and it's still not coming off. So it's a pretty head. I do love it. It just needs some work. But, you know, I do know that it's kind of a new thing for LAC to be doing these heads. I didn't have this problem with the last head, so I'm not sure if it's something I'm doing or just something in general. Who's this? We do SL events. And that session I can check in a second. <sighs> all in all, it is a, cu a cute head. Just don't use Omegas. That's my my main thing. Just don't. Because there's no way to clear it afterwards. I thought maybe this was the clear, but no. Um, they should add like a little button here to clear. Because they have... Do they have it down here? No, they don't have it down here either. So, yeah, I guess that's kind of, kind of a bit of a pain. Other than that, it's a really cute head. Um, if you end up getting into trouble, just slap on a um, pair of glasses. <laughs> but it is adorable and et cetera, et cetera. Uh, for those of you who follow my Flickr, you're going to see a photo. Actually, my main photo is my friend and I playing this game here. This was actually, I blogged this already. It was a chess game um, that I got in my treasure chest. And it's from Rowanwood. Um, <clears throat> I blogged it when I got it, but since the new round is coming up soon for the treasure chest, I figured I would blog it again. And plus it seemed like a cool thing to do. And a way for me to prove to Matt that he's way too tall. <laughs> All right, so, and that's not just for hanging out with me, people. That is for anyone in general. Too tall. Guys, you do not have to be eight feet tall in Second Life. I mean, God, the majority of my male avatars are six foot four. And the majority of my female are anywhere between five foot four to six foot one. So, as you can tell, those are normal. I don't know what the heck, who put in your heads that you had to be eight feet tall or seven feet tall. <laughs> it's kind of silly. Don't you ever feel awkward going into a club and seeing all these little tiny avatars while well, you're this big freaking ogre of an avatar? Come on now. <laughs> Enough of that shit. You don't need that. Alright, so that is my quick review. And... Um, I am going to get out of this Maitreya body and put my avatar back on, which is Beliza. I absolutely love my Beliza, and I just, I need it back on. All right, so I guess that's it for now. Happy Halloween, and please follow my social media. And Dead Cell, if you're out there, you know you can add me. You just uh, actually, you know, have to say, hey, do you want to be friends? But the thing is, is that your profile is so unapproachable. I was just like, oh, wait, I was going to offer a friendship. And then I read your profile and I was just like, oh, never mind. I don't want to be muted. <laughs> okay. So, and by the way, all female, just saying. Okay. That's it. That's all. See you.